We are ready to go and we're just waiting on the last one. All right, so now all four of them are green. So all four batteries are charged 100%, ready to go into an Xbox controller and play some games. Special thanks to the company for sending me this to create an unboxing video and show you guys. This is a four pack of Xbox rechargeable batteries. And so of course, we're gonna get on the overhead rig, unbox them, take a look at what comes inside of here, charge them up and see them actually work inside of an Xbox One controller. Sorry about the uh, crushed box. That's how it was delivered directly to my house. Not the company's fault, nor mine. All right, so let's get on the overhead rig, unbox this and uh, see what we have. All right, so this is a four pack of rechargeable batteries for Xbox, Xbox Series S and X, as well as Xbox One. Sorry about the uh, damaged box. That's how it was shipped to me. Battery pack with charging station, long playing time, widely compatibility, high speed charging. There's the uh, product weight and some specifications. There's company info over here, including an email address, which is mygift2022 at Outlook 2022, okay. The back battery pack which with charger station. So essentially all four of these will pop into this one station and charge. Uh, lights off means standby mode. Green is fully charged and red means that it's charging. So let's break into our broken, crushed box here and see what we have. On top of course, a instruction manual. Shouldn't, uh, Oh, look at that, they included a, um, wow, they included a USB-C type cable to charge this with, very nice. One 1500 milliamp hour battery, two 1500 milliamp hour batteries, three 1500 milliamp hour batteries, four 1500 milliamp hour batteries. And that's it for the box. And then this is our charging deck. Look at that, very nice and simple. Absolutely love that. Got a little bit of grip here on the bottom. USB-C port right on the back. Let's open these up, let's take a look at them. So they'll just, uh, oh, they, they have this little indicator here. So that's, that's in there. All right, this one open. go all four of them are plugged in ready to charge get our uh, USB cable here looks like maybe two feet and let's plug it into the front here and then we'll take this out and let's uh, heck I guess we'll plug it into the Xbox to charge got me an old Samsung power brick that my friend left and then this whole thing of Xbox batteries now originally I was gonna put it uh, to the Xbox but I saw I had a whole power strip there so I figured I'll just plug it directly in, that way I don't have something plugged into my Xbox. I'm going to set it here. Plug this into here. This is a good power brick, it's just he was a tattoo artist and left it and got tattoo ink on it. And then I'll plug this into the main power strip here. You can see that they are red, so they are uh, plugged in, they're charging. We'll let these batteries get to 100% and then uh, I'll try them out in an actual controller. So it's been maybe two hours and three of the four are charged. Those three are ready to go and we're just waiting on the last one. All right, so now all four of them are green. So all four batteries are charged 100%, ready to go into an Xbox controller and play some games. Now I'm just gonna slide out one of them. Now I have the battery in my hand. Let's go pop this in an Xbox controller. And this controller is currently showing about half battery. So let's see what it looks like once we get the new battery in it. All right, so we've got our nice new battery. We're going to first pop the back off, of course, and then take this battery out. And then this is the new one, and we'll be able to take it. And you'll actually see this little indention is right over here. So it allows you to just put that in like so. So essentially take this end with the two connectors and the sticking out plastic piece, and you'll put it down in the controller like this. It actually even says face to RT key direction, and then just kind of push this side in and boom. Now your battery is in place. Put your uh, plastic cover back on. 
And there you go. This battery should also charge when it's plugged in directly to the console. So now let's go, let's power this on and see what our battery's at. Look at that. Now we got a full battery. So uh, this is on an Xbox One X. This also works with the Xbox One, the Xbox Series X, and the Xbox Series S. So uh, 1500 milliamps should last a good while. Um, and as I mentioned with the way they're designed, you could leave them in the controller and should be able to use a play and charge kit with this battery pack also. So there we go. That should essentially do it for this Xbox for this Xbox four pack charging station. Now, I think that this is truly something great for a family or somebody that has a lot of Xbox One controllers. By having this four pack, you can just get them charged. Once they're green, grab your battery when you need it. And if you don't have a play and charge kit, just go out and swap the battery. If you have a play and charge kit, just leave it in your controller and plug it into your console and you're good to go. So I definitely like this. Uh, I think that it is great because we use our Xbox a lot in the living room and my daughter uses her Xbox a lot in her bedroom. So uh, now we'll have a nice mutual station for all of our batteries. So whenever her controller dies or my controller dies, I should be able to walk right in here, grab me a new battery and be good to go. So of course, I'll have these linked down below in the description if you'd like to grab a four pack of these Xbox batteries, of these Xbox controller batteries for yourself. And if you can, click that like button, click subscribe and indulge in your life at Indulge Clothing for the merch. And I'll see you all in the next video. Deuces.